drivers behind the lines in three, two, one, go. And it's the autonomous period in match number four here in the upper bracket on active field in Troy. All six robots working. Automation Nation working at getting a balance over on the red side. Blue Devils didn't quite make it on the blue side as we move into the teleoperated period. Five points between these teams. It was 29 to 24, five. Over on the red alliance, the Hammerheads move into the red loading zone as their rookie partners, the Pioneers, grab a game piece and move to the red community to do some scoring. Meanwhile, on the blue alliance, Juggernauts move out to grab another game piece. As 71-88, that's the Saddlebots, also score for blue. The Blue Devils up and over the charging station. Cone in possession. Let's see what they can do with it. They shoot high and they score high. And that is two links for blue. Red yet to make their first link. I think they're just going to do it now. As we've got about 70 seconds left in this one. Still a close match. Only 10 points apart between these alliances. Automation Nation shooting across the field after they score. Hammerheads also with a cone in, prog in possession up and over the charge station into the red community to get some scoring done. We've got 45 seconds left in this one. One point, one point between these alliances make it two. Red has two links, blue has three as we get close to end game. Blue now has four links. Red still working on their third. As we have all three blue robots working the charge station, all three red robots working it. There is about 10 seconds left. We've got a double triple and with six seconds, this match is over. A score of 132 to 126. Alliance number three will stay up in the upper bracket. Alliance number six will go down into the lower bracket to fight another day.